Yeah. Hello everyone and welcome to another Detroit Become Human video. This one is really interesting and I don't think you're going to see this anywhere else on YouTube because I'm not sure anybody else has figured it out. I'm calling this video the Zombie Connor Glitch. And the reason why we call it the Zombie Connor Glitch is because we ran into a scenario in where we chose to become Deviant. We were Deviant Connor on the Jericho. But what happened was I chose to have Connor go ahead and get killed within Jericho during the whole raid. But somehow, he came back as Deviant Connor and he became leader, which ultimately caused the whole game to softlock and break and made it so I couldn't advance anymore. And I still can't. So the game's just stuck there. So you guys will kind of see what happened, but it involved these steps. Marcus was kicked out of Jericho and came back. And then he also got killed when he tried to save North. Connor went ahead and tried to blow up the C4 in the bottom of Jericho because Marcus was kicked out and he failed. Also, Hank went ahead and committed suicide. Those are all the things that I can think of. Oh, and Simon was dead too. Not sure if that matters, but these are like the circumstances that were revolving around whatever ended up happening here. And it created some interesting dialogue, but it was really weird how it all froze up. So if you guys have any theories as to why this happened the way it did, let me know in the comments down below. But without me talking anymore here, here you go. Here's what happened. Here's what it looked like when we were discovering the zombie Connor glitch. I'll teach you to act like a hero asshole. I always guarantee you that's what happens. Marcus. Are you alright? They're everywhere. They're killing anyone they can find. We gotta get out of here. There's nothing we can do. Marcus, I'm sorry. There's no time. Come on. Car hinges on the revolution? Oh well, yeah, but it'd be no different than just doing a Marcus Revolution. Like, it's not a big deal. <laughs> Kara's face the same. Oh. The north scene's different if Connor never finds Jericho. Oh uh, yeah. You know, it probably would be a little bit different. They just... Okay, I'm gonna suck at all of this. I would love if you just, like, hit her with it. Either way, I want to see if they both die here. Maybe it just turns into a camp ski ending. No, it wouldn't turn into a camp ski ending because... Because Connor's not deactivated. Marcus! Does North get away? Oh, North gets away. Okay. So North gets away if Marcus messes up here. Okay. Well, that's good to know. Wait! This one's mine. Nowhere to run. Nowhere to hide. Later. We found several hundred androids in the hall, sir. Take them away. Yes, sir. They cleared the ship in order the men to withdraw. Interesting. So, the rest of this is going to be Machine Connor and Revolution North. Marcus died buying time for Jericho. What's that at? Zero percent? Hey, go me. Yeah, so we still gotta watch this. But it's probably Machine Connor, right? What? Somebody messed up. This should not be Deviant Connor. <laughs> Is he gonna be at the freaking church? <laughs> Somebody broke. <laughs> I know I'm responsible for what happened, Lieutenant. I want you to know I'm sorry. This is what happens when you play the game too much. The game just starts melting. <laughs> I needed to see you, Lieutenant. In spite of all of our differences, I'm glad I had the chance to meet you. I'm super confused right now. <laughs> I know I've said this before, Lieutenant, but you should stop drinking. It's going to kill you. Do you think he'd like 
Is he still Machine yeah, Connor? He died and came back. I feel like he's talking like Machine Connor. I feel like he said something to Super Machine Connor there. Give anything to hold him again. Deviant Connor sniping on the roof? <laughs> that would be so amazing. I understand. Now leave me alone. Go on, complete your mission, since that's all you care about. <laughs> we confused the crap out of the game. Get out of here! What if he's at the church? I'll be so confused if he's at the church. Because this should not be happening right now with Deviant Connor. I don't know, man. I'm really excited now. Is Connor going to be sitting there or is it going to be North? Oh my god. What? How is Connor still alive? He just got... <laughs> oh, we broke the game. We did it. So, if you get Marcus killed, Connor comes back? <laughs> we broke it. We did it. Go me. But I can talk about Marcus here now. Wait, what? What? I know how important Marcus was to Jericho and to your people. He's the one who opened my eyes, showed me who I really am. That freaking soldier opened your eyes too when he shot you in the head. I'm so confused about that. The humans won't take any risks. They're rounding up the androids and taking them to camps for extermination. In a couple hours, we'll be the only ones left. How many survived the attack? <laughs> the zombie Connor playthrough, it's man. Hard to say. <laughs> a few hundred. We could oh, yeah. <laughs> Wait, what? Did I break the game? Oh no, it's broken! I can't- that's just where it ended! No, I can't do anything! <laughs> okay, so I want to go to the main menu and then confirm. And we're going to click resume and then see what it does. Yeah, it doesn't know what to do because Connor's not supposed to be here. We did it, chat. The new zombie Connor ending. He comes back from the dead, talks about Marcus, and he just sit there in purgatory in the church. Because really, really, Connor shouldn't be here. This should not be happening. Like, he should have been dead. But yeah, it keeps loading into this, so... I mean, it's possible that it glitched, and if I go back and do it over again, that it'll fix itself. <laughs> but I don't know. What's super weird about it, though, is that, like... Market. So there must be something that's getting broken with the fact that the ship didn't blow up. And Marcus died and Connor died. Right? Like, there's a bunch of conflicting things here right now. I still want to... Oh, wait, no. We can't get Simon as leader because North can't die there. Forget about that. So... I'm really curious if it breaks again. Risks. Rounding up the androids and taking them to camps for extermination. In a couple hours, we'll be the only ones left. How many survived the attack? 
It's hard to say. A few hundred? We could have saved more if we detonated <laughs> that bomb. <gasps> See, like, the conversation still happened. Wait, what? I didn't even hear her talk about that last time because I still wasn't expecting this. We could have saved more if we detonated that bomb. So this is supposed... Okay, I'm trying to think this through. How could this actually be happening where these lines would work? Because we could have saved more if we detonated that bomb. That is a very specific line to this situation. That means that, Mar that Connor has to fail and Marcus has to die because we have the Marcus thing unlocked. Either way, it's soft lock ag again, but like, yeah, I can't, by the way, I can't do anything. I can't touch anything. It's broken. This is just where it ends. So, either way, this is super goofy because she talks about how the ship didn't explode, but we also talk about Marcus dying. We don't talk about how Connor died, but whatever. <clears throat> So, like, okay, so what I'm trying to figure out is she says the bomb didn't even go off. What I'm trying to understand is what situation would she ever be able to say that to Connor? Ever. Like, this shouldn't be happening. Right? There should never be a time where the bomb doesn't go off where she can say this to Connor. Yeah, because this is what ended up happening, right? Deviant Connor was destroyed on the ship, which is a whole bunch of zero percents, which explains why nobody has any clue this could happen. <laughs> and then what happened then was Marcus left Jericho, but then he came back, right? And then he was in the corridor and then he failed to save North, which also resulted in Marcus dying to buy time for Jericho. Somehow, that causes Connor to come back as a deviant. Now, I'm not sure if it also is because Hank killed himself. Like, maybe the Hank thing is what's causing this. Like, we also have to keep in mind that Hank was hostile this whole time. Maybe Hank is breaking this. But either way, we went into the... Hank suicide scene with Deviant Connor, even though Connor just got shot in the head. <laughs> Memory of Connor be downloaded into a new model. Deviancy isn't. Oh well, no, that's not. No, we already see that that's not how that works. Here's the situation. Let's say Connor becomes a Deviant, and then you escape the Jericho. In the church, Marcus can go ahead and shoot Connor, and that gets rid of Deviant Connor. And they send in another Connor, and it's a machine Connor. So we we just broke something basically. <laughs> we did it. I'm happy about this. I'm okay with ending the stream on that note. We'll have to come back and do more things, but I'm super okay with like, <laughs> that's it. <laughs> so let me know what you guys thought, what you think happened and how this happened. And I, again, it was repeatable. I was able to do it over and over and over again. It's still stuck there. I'll have to redo my save file or, you know, at least rewind a little bit. So it's interesting that that happened. If you guys want to see more videos, we are going to be covering The Walking Dead, the final season, in a lot of detail when that comes out, similar to how we've done this Detroit stuff. And then, you know, a bunch of other games are coming out. We probably will be doing We Happy Few, which is actually coming out in like two days. Oh. And, ooh, maybe Monster Hunter's coming out tonight. I don't know. There's a bunch of games that are coming out. If you ever want to see me playing games that, you know, not necessarily are going to be on the YouTube channel, I do stream pretty often, too. So make sure you're following on Twitch, and maybe follow me on Twitter in case I'm not streaming on Twitch. I've had some weird... Had some weird health stuff going on lately, so I've been taking a little bit of a break with Twitch. But again, if you guys want to go ahead and follow me on Twitter, you'll know when I'm streaming. So, thank you guys for being here. You guys are awesome. Thanks for being so awesome with this whole Detroit series. We might do one or two more videos. I don't know. We'll see what we do with Detroit. But I feel like we've covered Detroit pretty extensively, and we might be just about done with it. So, thank you guys for being here. Like I said, you guys are awesome. And then I will see you in the next video. Hold on. Just a little while longer hold on just a little while longer